Boxers are dominating Muay Thai. Maybe that's too much. Boxing heavy Muay Thai styles are dominating Muay Thai. Here are three examples of traditional Thai styles getting starched by foreign fighters who are overwhelming the Thais with boxing. And this is just from today's fight card. Today, a lot of these guys are Olympian world champions and they are getting beaten by foreigners who are taking advantage of an outdated style. Take a look at the pressure being put on by these foreign fighters. They are coming in with sharp boxing combinations combined with excellent Muay Thai defensive technique especially in the clinch. They are also very good at defending the kicks along with having their own pretty good kicking arsenal but they are all heavily leaning into boxing. It's the obvious strategy. We heard it from the Russian fighters and we see it from the Chinese and the European fighters. They are all taking advantage of the weakness in this traditional style and that is an alarming lack of boxing prowess and heavily heavily leaning into power kicks. I don't know what to say because this is actually an alarming trend that we're seeing unfold in front of us. If you are a Thai especially, being a Lumpini world champion used to mean something. It meant that a killer was walking into the ring. But nowadays it seems like it means that they have an outdated style with an alarming lack of boxing prowess. Luckily for the Thais, the young bloods that are coming in such as Tao and Chai have good boxing. They have not gone towards the traditional style. Which is good to see for the future of Muay Thai in Thailand. But in the meantime, we're seeing a lot of these Lumpini world champions get starched. By the way guys, if you have nothing to do this Saturday during the UFC fight night card, why don't you come in and join my live. We can chop it up, talk fights, who knows, maybe even bet together, I don't know. But everyone's welcome in the ramen shop.